Welcome everyone. Hope you all are doing fine. Now, let us start. The first novel we have. The story is about Su Yang, a dual cultivator who was imprisoned for committing various offenses. He meets an old man who offers him a chance to be reincarnated and start anew. Su Yang vows to reunite with his former partners and find new ones. The summary does not specify the genre of the story. The rating given for the story is 86 out of 100. On to the next novel, we have. The novel, Birth of the Demonic Sword, tells the story of a young man who is accidentally killed and wakes up in a new world of cultivation. Noah Balvin, the protagonist, was a transmigrator with no purpose in his previous life, but in his new life, he aims to overcome his social status and become powerful enough to stand above everyone. The novel deals with his struggle to obtain power and stand free in the sky above anyone. With a rating of 86, this is a novel worth reading. On to the next novel, we have. The article is about a man named Conrad who possesses a powerful weapon known as the Golden Rod, which can turn innocent women into aggressive beasts. Various government intelligence agencies are after him to obtain the weapon, but he ultimately destroys it in a fit of anger. The article is titled, Profane Prince of Domination, and the reviewer gave it a rating of 88. On to the next novel, we have. The story is about a chat group for people with Chuni disease that called each other fellow Taoist, Palace Master, True Monarch, and other titles. They talk about pill refining, exploring ancient ruins, and techniques. The protagonist discovers that not everything in the group is what it initially appears to be. The reviewer gave the work a 90 rating. On to the next novel, we have. The title of the book is, Reverend Insanity, and the rating given by someone is 90. It is a story about a demon who is reborn in a world where everything is based on the use of GU. The storyline involves a time traveler and the cultivation and use of various types of GU. The demon character is depicted as doing whatever he desires. On to the next novel, we have. The title is, Overgeared, and the rating is 86. The story is about a man named Shin Youngwoo who has an unfortunate life and is stuck carrying bricks on construction sites. He also has to do labor in a virtual reality game called Satisfy. However, he discovers the Northern End Cave while on a quest and finds, Pagma's rare book, which helps him become a legendary class player named, Grid. On to the next novel, we have. The title is, Master Hunter K, and the rating is 86. The story involves people being teleported to fight battles or face annihilation, and K is sent back in time. On to the next novel, we have. The article is titled, Breakers, and the author's rating is 86. The article tells the story of the author, Ju In Gong, who was teased throughout his life because his name means, protagonist. However, the author has come to see his name as a type of foreshadowing. On to the next novel, we have. Lord of the Mysteries is a novel about a man named Klein Moretti who is reincarnated in an alternate Victorian-era world. He becomes entangled with the churches of the world and develops newfound powers thanks to the Beander potions. The novel features mystery and a world filled with machinery, cannons, dreadnoughts, airships, difference machines, as well as potions, divination, hexes, tarot cards, and sealed artifacts. It is rated 94 by the author. On to the next novel, we have. The Devil's Cage is a virtual underground game that offers no protection, where players fight for power, fortune, and survival. The protagonist, Chin Ran, enters the game to escape imminent death but faces the challenge of surviving both in the game and in real life. The overall rating for the book is 88, on to the next novel, we have. Shen Miao is a D daughter from a military lineage who falls in love with Prince Ding and becomes his wife, eventually becoming Empress. After six years of assisting her husband in battles and territory expansion, she is betrayed and loses everything, including her family. Upon rebirth at age 14, she vows to protect her family, avenge her enemies, and seize the imperial seat of the country. With the support of the obstinate Marquis from the Xie family, she sets out on her mission. On to the next novel, we have. The novel, Everyone Else is a Returnee, has a rating of 86 and tells the story of Yu Ilhan, 
who is left out of humanity's activities and ignored by God. He spends a thousand years preparing for a catastrophic event and becomes a legend when humanity returns and faces the cataclysm. On to the next novel, we have. The title of the story is, Black Tech Internet Cafe System, and the rating is 86. The story is about an MC who wakes up in a new world and discovers a system that allows him to run a virtual reality internet cafe. He introduces the cafe to cultivators who are amazed by the modern technologies like playing video games and drinking Sprite. The story follows the MC as he faces challenges from cultivation sects and major forces with his collection of modern treasures. On to the next novel, we have. I Alone Level Up is a story about Sung Jin Wu, an E-rank hunter who hunts monsters within the gate that connects the real world with the monster world. Despite being weak and having no skills, Jin Wu discovers a hidden catacomb with the hardest difficulty within the D-rank catacombs. On to the next novel, we have. A kid without innate ability chooses to follow the more difficult path of practicing external techniques to gain his father's respect in a distant galaxy. Years later, a mysterious meteoric crystal stone fuses with the young man's body and he undergoes drastic transformations. Eventually, his father discovers that his son possesses astonishing abilities. On to the next novel, we have. The Desolate Era is a story about a man named Ji Ning who suffered from illnesses and knew he would die young. However, he is reborn into a world of immortals, monsters, and powerful beings. In this new world, Ji Ning vows to never be weak again and aims to make the Desolate Era his own. The reviewer gives it a rating of 86. On to the next novel, we have. Martial World is a story about Lin Ming's adventure to become a hero in the land after finding a mysterious object that many legends battled over. The overall rating for this story is 88. 80. On to the next novel, we have. The King's Avatar is a story about a top-tier pro player named Yi Shu who is kicked from his team and becomes an internet cafe manager. When the game Glory launches its 10th server, Yi Shu returns to the game and begins his journey to the summit with his incomplete, self-made weapon. The novel won the title for Best Work in 2013 and has 23 million hits on Kidian. It is also the first and only 1,000 pledged work in the gaming category with 4.6 million recommendations. On to the next novel, we have. A Will Eternal follows the story of Bai Shaochen, a young man driven by a fear of death and a desire to live forever. Despite his quirks, he treasures friendship and family. The book receives an 88 out of 100 rating. The tagline, Only My Will, is eternal, highlights the power of the will. On to the next novel, we have. The novel, Renegade Immortal, is about a smart boy named Wang Lin who gains the chance to become an immortal, but initially lacks talent. Despite being shunned by his relatives, Wang's loving parents have high hopes for him. The story follows Wang as he strives to become a real immortal by overcoming his lack of talent. The reviewer gave it an 86 rating. On to the next novel, we have. The title of the story is, I Shall Seal the Heavens, and the rating given is 86. The story is set between the 8th and 9th mountains where the strong prey upon the weak. The protagonist's name is Meng Hao and he is the 9th generation demon sealer who aims to seal the heavens. On to the next novel, we have. A player of the game, Lost World, becomes number one and realizes that it was just practice for building a fantasy civilization in real life. Rating. 92. That's the end of this video. I will see you soon in the next video. Happy reading.